Hello there, I'm Anpreet and I make book related videos on my channel and today I'm going to make a video which will help out a lot of budding booktubers and it's about the mistakes you need to avoid while starting a booktube channel. Now I am not claiming to be this huge booktuber but obviously I have learned a few things while booktubing and also I'm a marketing professional so I know a little bit more than usual about things so that kind of helps sometimes although I do not really have time to put that you know knowledge into my channels but i think i can still help you out with this endeavor of yours to start an amazing booktube channel and to be an amazing and awesome booktuber so without further ado let me get started with this video and i'm really sorry about the background i shifted to a new place and i had no idea that the packers and movers will mess up and not deliver my products on time so my stuff is with them and i have to just make peace with this setup Anyway, number one thing that you need to avoid is lack of commitment and consistency. Now, a lot of people think of starting something, anything, not even a booktube channel, anything. And most of the times, you know, maybe they get discouraged by slow growth or there are other priorities and that's why they are not consistent. So let's say if you're saying you are going to make one video a week and if you're not making that, that would be you not being consistent and you digging your own grave. Because you cannot be successful at YouTubing for sure if you're not consistent. People are not going to follow you. People are not going to trust you. YouTube is not going to trust you and make sure that you grow in the organic way. So if you don't want that to happen, be consistent make a schedule and follow it but at the same time try that you are not making one video a week at least three videos a week would be a good start because you know the more content you make the more youtube favors you and if you slow down your content if you don't make your content on time youtube is going to kill your reach so make sure you do that number two lack of communication now i see a lot of youtubers who are just making videos but they are not you know really engaging you have to remember that youtube is a social media so if you're not being social it is of no use it will hamper your growth and you know it will just be a wasted effort so when I talk about communication, I want you to talk to other people. I want you to talk to the subscribers you have. I want you to engage with all the comments. I want you to, uh, you know, uh, go to other channels and engage with them. You have to be a part of the community if you want to be successful. So do that. Number three mistake to avoid is not looking at the big picture. You cannot just, you know, do it for a long time as a hobby. Even if it's your hobby, make it serious for yourself. Be professional and be clear about your goals. What are you going to do with your channel? Where do you see yourself with this channel you are going to make or you have made in next five years? What is your vision of making this channel? What is your purpose of making this channel? How do you plan to grow it? If you do not have all those things thought out, you will be like me making videos on and off for two years and getting about thousand subscribers in two years if you get serious about it if you make your hobby serious enough and start putting your consistent effort and make a really focused attempt on this thing you are going to excel at that you can move from thousand to almost four thousand subscribers on a booktube channel in india in about six seven months so that is possible only if you're willing to try and only if you're willing to give enough effort into it number four not focusing on the quality now there are a lot of people with silly advice out there i i say you know a lot of people say you know if you want to start a book you channel, quality really doesn't matter the camera doesn't really matter you just have to have you just have to make a video no it doesn't happen that way you won't get any subscribers in fact, you'll be losing the people who will somehow discover you and see you being so pathetic. Because if your content doesn't have quality, if your video doesn't have quality, if your audio doesn't have quality, you are not going to impress people. And if you're not going to impress people, forget about having any subscribers or making it successful on YouTube okay or on booktube so you have to think about the framing the camera quality the video quality as a whole you know the audio the editing the background the lighting everything has to be thought out and perfect i totally agree that you cannot do it in a day 
but you can always build on it right for example i built all my equipment and everything one by one and still some things go wrong my background is wrong today but at the same time i feel like people will see that at least she's trying maybe she doesn't have this one thing not perfect but she has all other things perfect so people would be there for you if you are being this dedicated to your channel and the last mistake you need to avoid is not focusing on the personality of your channel what do i mean by that now it's a very big concept called personal branding and making yourself sound and be unique in a gist or in the most basic manner i can tell you that you need to have your unique personality you need to open up to the camera right now like see look at me i'm making this video am i talking to you guys no i'm talking to this stupid camera which doesn't even look nice and which makes me realize about this pathetic thing i'm doing like the background thing it's pathetic otherwise i have my videos i love them but just think this this is really difficult people may think it's easy talking to a camera but it is not it is not easy to you know bring out your personality and sometimes you are like you know you are like a different kind of person and you need to be a different kind of person on camera for example i know that a lot of people appreciate when i have like good pauses in my videos and everything but most of the times i am not able to do that because i'm just being myself i'm just talking like i have to catch a train and most of the times it's not that amazing so just think about it i try in every single video of mine to make my videos better in form of personality or how i present my videos how i do my scripts how i do my filming how do i put my topics how do i you know just speak or how do i just you know shoot all of those things matter and if you're not focusing on them and if you're not improving one thing at a time every single day then you are not doing enough for a booktube channel if you have to make a booktube channel you have to be like that i am telling you guys don't think that it's easy booktube may be an awesome community but having a reach on booktube channel is way too difficult than having some other channels give you a 100% effort and improve every single aspect of your videos today i told you about the five mistakes you can avoid and i am hoping it helps you out if you are new here or if you haven't watched my previous video about tips on how to start a booktube channel i'll link it down below and i would urge you to check that out as well and i am really hoping this helps you get some kind of clarity and understand some basic things that you need to have in your to do list to make your channel better to make your videos better and Yes, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, do hit a thumbs up and do share it with your friends who you think can be great booktubers or who are looking forward to being a booktuber and they are trying to improve themselves. Do share it with them. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is Manpi signing off. I'll be back with another video very soon.